Hello and welcome to Leaderboard, the daily English masterclass for business. Today's theme is communication and today's lesson is how to sharpen your focus, part one. Do you ever find yourself wasting your day? Well, it doesn't have to be this way. All you need to do is focus on finishing this article to find out how little changes can make a big difference. Are you game? You are not alone when it comes to distractions. It's not easy staying on task when you need to focus for hours at a time. But some people are able to do it. The question is, why them and not you? Let's look at how we can keep our eyes on the prize. First, keep your goals in mind. First things first. Why do you even need to focus? Do you want to become a skilled guitar player? Do you want to write a novel? Do you want to start working from home? Think about it. Next, reduce the chaos and focus on only two or three important tasks. If you have 20 tasks you need to do every day, how effective do you think your focus ability will be? Terrible, right? You can't expect to do those things with sophistication if you are too scatterbrained to focus. Next, do those tasks as soon as possible. In order to make sure you get those two to three tasks done, you need to do them early. This means as soon as you wake up, you need to be already plotting how to do them. Next, focus on only the smallest part of your work at a time. An easy way to kill your focus is to see an epic goal for the giant accomplishment that it is. Most goals will take at least a few weeks or even months to accomplish. And knowing that can make it feel like it'll take forever to do. Finally, visualize yourself working. Champion runners use this technique to great effect, usually by working backwards. They imagine themselves winning at first, then they act out the whole process in reverse, feeling and visualizing each step all the way to the beginning. So, take a moment out of your day to think about these simple tactics that lead to a smoother workflow and a clearer objective. Remember, to change your habits is never an easy process, but small steps can take us a great distance if we play the long game and remain persistent. Today's key words to note and remember are effective, scatterbrained, accomplishment, backwards, workflow, and persistent. Thank you very much for spending this time with me today. This is The Leaderboard, a daily English masterclass for business. Wherever you are, I wish you a fantastic day.